Welcome back to the Daily Minute. And for those of you in the United States, Happy Independence Day. Now, there are times when God gives instructions based on something that is true for a certain individual or group. At other times, the Lord works within a truth that is eternal and works through all people. Let's see this in Romans chapter 4 and verse 23. Now, it was not written for his sake alone that it was imputed to him. The Lord wanted us to know that this application of righteousness to Abraham wasn't just based on his circumstance alone. Gaining righteousness through trusting in the God of the universe is what we call an eternal truth. This is a method of God pronouncing someone righteous or holy in every time and instance. We can't gain status with God by anything we do, but by simply believing in what he's already done or promised. This will forever and always be the case. Let's pray. I want to thank you for giving us these eternal truths. That, Father, this is the way to be righteous, to trust in you. We thank you and praise you. Bless in Jesus' name. Amen. I'd love to hear about the things that God's been teaching you through his word. Let us know what he's been doing in your life by writing in the comment section below. And if you need prayer, please feel free to email me at shinethelightforhim at mail.com. Thank you for spending time with us. Make sure to join us tomorrow when we look at how this eternal truth also applies to you and me. May the Lord bless you. I'll see you tomorrow.